Second down and two. UTEP at the SMU 32-yard line. Sears is wing right. They give it away to Marcus Thomas. Marcus Thomas trying to find running room. Now breaks away. 30, 25, far side of the 20, the 15, the 10. And he's finally swung out of bounds by Bryce Hudson at the five-yard line. What a remarkable effort by Marcus Thomas. 27 yards. It'll be first and goal miners at the SMU 5. Such a good kid. I tell you what, he's got strong, strong legs. He probably would like to have had a little bit more success this year, but he's running hard today. Wow. Running hard. They can't bring him down. Of course, Thomas had a 100-yard game last week, the first for the Miners in their last 17 games. 11 carries and one half of play for 105 yards. Vinito drops the throw. Pretty good protection. Steps. He's going long up the right side for West. Joe has it inside the 15 and is taken out of bounds by David Haynes at about the 11-yard line. And I think the Mustangs messed up the coverage there. Vitito turns, gives it away to Thomas, hit in the backfield, breaks the tackle at the 10 at the 5, he's into the end zone! Touchdown, Miners! Marcus Thomas has had some kind of a first half, and he has the Miners on the board again. All right, it's an onside kick, and the ball is loose, UTEP's got a shot at it! Who's got it? Miners have it, UTEP's got it! Wow. Jose Martinez pulls it off again. Mike Price tells me that Martinez is better at it than anyone he's ever had. I have to say, uh, me too, John. I haven't seen anybody that's that proficient. And, so jo- the- and John, a Mustang hit that ball it was right. as it was in the air. Mustang Miners will have it at the Mustangs' 41-yard line. First down, and let's see if they can capitalize here. Vitito turns, gives it away to Thomas. Outside left, 40. Cuts it back, hammers inside the 35, and has the first down at the Mustangs' 31-yard line. Marcus Thomas running as well today, Bernie, as I think we've ever seen him run. No question about it. And I don't think, uh, as I said, I watched SMU against TCU on film during the week, and uh, that's not a weak defense out there. This defense is pretty rugged, and uh, and it'll come and pop you in the nose, and this kid's running right through him. Miners successfully executing his second onside kick in the last three weeks. They did it two weeks ago tonight at Aggie Memorial Stadium. Lauren Sam is the quarterback. He's out of the gun. Snap is back. Sam quarterback draw. Left side, 30, 25, 20. Breaks the tackle at the 10, the 5. He's into the end zone. Touchdown, Miners. Lauren Sam running hard, 31 yards, and UTEP is right back in the ball game. Galloway to hold. Sam Bennett to snap, and this to add to the Mustangs' lead. Snap is high, Galloway handles it, now rolling to his left side, dumps it off, and it's incomplete, and the Miners are going to take over on downs. Do you believe it? A bad snap. Galloway had to come out of his stance to handle it, and the Miners are going to have it at their own 10-yard line. Wow. Sam out of the shotgun. The snap is back. Sam, play fake, coming right. First down and more at the 10 at the 5. He's into the end zone. Touchdown, Miners! Lauren Sam put it into Jason Williams' belly. He pulled it out of there, came right. And does he run hard? A 12-yard touchdown run for Lauren Sam, and the Miners are an extra point away from tying the game. Just a different dimension out there, and again, uh, Jeff is down there seeing all that firsthand, but uh, the kids just got tremendous speed. Second and long. Vitito drops the throw, steps, delivers the ball left toward the end zone, has got him in, and it is caught! Yes! It is caught for a minor touchdown by Jeff Moturi! Great catch by Moturi! And the Miners have closed in once again. Defensive backs uh, down there questioning the, the uh, officials, saying, you know, he was out of bounds. But uh, if he would have had a chance to come down, he was definitely in. He pushed him out. So and the Miners put together well, a scoring drive of their challenge own. It, John. 
third and 15. The Miners at their own 40-yard line. Twins to the right. Receiver wide to the left. And Vitito will throw. Pretty good time. Steps, delivers right. It's caught along the near far sideline by Lawrence first Sam. Down. It's a first down in SMU territory at the 43-yard line. Good protection by that offensive line. And Vitito located Sam. They needed 15. They got 17 first and 10 for UTEP with 229 left in regulation. Twins to each side. Vitito backpedals to throw. The rush coming from the outside. He fires, and it's caught by Moturi inside the 25. He's taken down at the 22-yard line. It'll be a first and 10 for the Miners. They spot it at the 21. 19 yards on the hookup. First and 10 with 146 left in regulation time. What a throw, guys. I mean, that was right in the middle of that zone, and I mean, he put it right on the button. you got to figure, Jeff, now you, we got three and a half more years of this kid. He's just going to get better and better and better. Thomas to the right of Vitito. Nothing seems to bother him. Two receivers left, one to the right side. Vitito's got the snap. Sets to throw. Fires over the middle. It's caught inside the 10-yard line by Lauren Sam. It'll be first and goal miners at the SMU 6-yard line with 1.21 left in regulation time. Second and goal. The ball is just inside the 10-yard line. 14 seconds left. The miners cannot stop the clock. Moturi in motion. Vitito to throw. He's under a rush. He scrambles to his right. He fires. It's caught inside the five. Sears stretches out and scores! Touchdown, Miners! Wow! I am telling you. Vinito was flushed out of the pocket by Corey Muse. He scrambled to his right side, located Sears... At about the three-yard line, the senior tight end, who has had some problems hanging on to the ball, caught it and stretched it over the goal line. The Miners are an extra point away from tying the game. Look at this offensive line. They're all kind of huddled together and saying, let's go, and Lauren Sam's in the game. I like this right here. They've had trouble with Lauren Sam today. So Morstead, a 23-yard field goal to open the overtime and now the Miners will try and at least answer or perhaps better what the Mustangs have done the Miners have a golden opportunity to steal a road victory here in Dallas three receivers left one to the right side Sam is the quarterback the snap is back Sam quarterback draw he's in trouble he's rolling to his left side 25 and Sam breaks a tackle to the 20 and all the way to the 16-yard line. Lauren Sam was in trouble and somehow extricated himself from the jam and winds up picking up almost nine yards. It'll be second down and about a yard and a half to go. Brandon Jones and David Haynes made the tackle. I think Sam may have had his best game in a UTEP uniform oh, today. Brandon. He has been brilliant. Sam with Thomas to his left out of the shotgun. No mistakes can be made here. The snap, low. Sam fakes to Thomas, coming left. He's got the first down, and he's out of bounds on the near side at the 10-yard line. Now we'll see if the Miners can get a first down, or it's going to be first and goal here. This is a big situation. John, after that first run by Lauren Sam, this sideline erupted for Utah. He has got everybody fired up right now with that powerful run. And, you know, he's just something special. And I think you're right. I'd agree with you. I think this is his best game in a minor uniform. Well, the Miners started a man onto the field, and now they send him back. The play clock's at 15. It is a first and goal at the 10-yard line. Ball on the left hash. Thomas to the right of Sam. Play clock at 5. The snap is back. Sam gives it away to Thomas. Coming left. 10-5. He's into the end zone. Touchdown, Miners! UTEP has won their conference USA opener here at Ford Stadium in Dallas. Listen to the minor fans throughout Ford Stadium. victory for you. 
in the fourth quarter. The Miners have beaten SMU in overtime here at Ford Stadium in Dallas. And listen to the chant across the way. 